Testing, testing, one, two, three. Is this mic on? All right, then. All right, let me just check if the phone... Okay, it's working. Uh, hey, guys. These guys were wondering why have I been long for short something. So I couldn't record for an entire month and as well. So yeah, my OBS was so it couldn't record any PC content, but I've been recording some console content lately, which I'll be uploading sometime later after this video. Right? Oh, oh my god, I'm using a wrist toys, am I? aren't I? Yeah, I am. Uh, hang on, I'll be right back. Uh, let me just cut this out. Alright, I got impact working, so now we're back on the road. Now I've been, exper now, I've been experimenting lately on Minecraft with mods as well as texture packs. Now, my favorite one but I'm not gonna use it for when I do base tours otherwise it's not gonna show the original thing so sorry it's generate chunks uh, let's turn off ESP first and storage ESP so that way that's not annoying all right then so yeah. but yeah anyway I'm wearing a Roman skin again because long story short I got it I am in a bit of a Roman phase because I've been reading too much of Julius Caesar but anyway so this is the Valley of Wheat it, it was an original landmark built way before the Russia War, but it was later grieved by the Resistance, later built by Nita T and some of the Resistance members, including being some of her members in Aurora, then later grieved again by different, different groups who came into the base. Today, if I were to show you what the Valley of Wheat looks like now, I suggest you watch this YouTuber link in the description. So, yeah. So let's start off first from here. This is a port for those who come by boat. Go to where, and sorry for the noise. Uh, it's a bit of a noisy neighborhood today. So here we have the ports for those who come in by boat to the Valley of Wheat. Now the architecture here is what I really love considering it is made completely in the form of like an Egyptian style considering, you know, multiple sphinxes and a few pyramids here and there. Here, but I like the sphinxes. Now the rule of the Valley of Wheat was is that you were allowed to take as much wheat as you wanted as long as you promised to replant the wheat. If you refused to do so, you would be killed. No joke. Now this, yeah, this is the Pyramid of the Valley of Wheat and it's, yeah, it's built by, okay, this is, I don't know if this is made by the creator, but all I know this is like, yeah. Alright, so just like the one I did for my Valk, on my Space Valkyria, this does, this is what I did on Space Valkyria. Uh, this is like what I did on Space Valkyria. This is the the chests won't contain any of the items that came from 2B2T. So sorry about that. Uh, like, oh, what? Oh, what's that over there? Is this stronghold is that part of the structure? I think it's part of the structure. What is wrong with my rendering distance right now? What the heck is happening? Minecraft, you are acting laggier than usual, and I hate it. Anyway. Wait, this vase is pretty big, so let me toggle on the free camera real quick, so... So the Valley of Wheat is... Very, very big by a few hundred... I think a thousand blocks, maybe? Uh, yeah, I think it's so. I've never been to the Valley of Wheat myself, considering I've never been able to travel far distances except once, but that was a long time ago, and I wasn't as paranoid as I was now. Today I'm a bit paranoid due to the fact of 2 ptts climate, so that's why I don't travel much and I prefer not to be online anymore. <laughs> Though I still like to sometimes do, but I am, but just to check on how's the server doing and everything else and whatnot. So yeah. Now another rule of the Valley of Wheat was is that you weren't allowed to place any other structure besides a sign, so you could act, it's a guest house, pyramid of, yeah that's a pyramid of mules I guess, that's where you put mules, pyramid of souls. Hmm. The guy who built this flood all. So yeah, this is the so this is So yeah, the guest house was here, as it says here. What's this? <clears throat> okay, so this was created by Jang. And I just forgot because there are multiple because a lot of people visited the Valley of Weed and I 
got confused if Jang was either the creator or the guy, one of the people who visited the Valley of Wheat. <coughs> Excuse me. So you have Jared 2013 here. Jared, this is very cool. Well, py pyrobite. Oh, pyrobite. It's here. Oh, well. Bye. Hmm. Huh. So this is... Oh, so some of the stuff did get here. Free items. This is for travelers. Hmm. Huh. So Jang was very kind to leave a few items for people. The guest bed, free bed. Okay, so he, so he was kind enough to leave a few things for people here. Now you can see the coordinates on my right. This is the actual location of the Valley of Wheat if you guys want to check out what remains of it. Now the Valley of Wheat doesn't look like this anymore. Today it looks like a smoldering crater from Fallout 2. So, I mean from Fallout 3. <laughs> it looks more like a smoldering crater from Fallout 3. So when you go there, it pretty much looks like Fallout. So... <clears throat> Yeah, this was pretty much like a safe. It's pretty much like how melons were pretty much praised across 2B to T. This was also for newbies who came by because for those who came by, this was a pretty great place to come by, grab a whole lot of ma wheat, make bread, and eat so you wouldn't have to starve to death. But I preferred melons mainly because melons are easier to plant considering you don't have to replant anything. Stems stay there, and oh crap, I fell into the nether. But yeah, I like the uh, I like the design they added here with all these nether portals on top of each pyramid. So there's not much in each pyramid. It's mainly chests. Now we saw th this is the one for the uh, the ones at the pyramid of mules, but I didn't see anything in there here yet so far. So this here, okay. Here quest two, blah blah blah, free bread, giant. Now, yeah. Now the future 2B2T video I will post is my story on 2B2T, but I will not narrate it because, for one, I have a bit of phlegm in my uh, in my throat, so it's hard for me to speak very long. So, without <clears throat> that, so yeah, so it'll be like my so just like my what I did on the story of the Prussians of 2B2T video. It'll just go with music and a few slides with words rather than me narrating my entire story through my voice because it's not easy to talk right now considering I have a bit of flow. <sighs> anyway, anyway, so yeah, there are more sphinxes here, more spires of fire, as well as this temple. Wait, is this a temple? Yeah, it is a temple. No, it's a pyramid. And oh my god, that's a big structure. Now I do not know how to get in here because I've explored this map before I decided to do this tour but I never could find a darn entrance so sorry for those who want to go underground. Uh, oh wait, there are a few but not all. So which one's this one though, free bread journey? Am I back to where I started? I don't think so. Am I? What's, what's this one though? Huh. I didn't see this before when I tried to look for when I tried to go down here. What's this? Oh, it's a mine shaft. Oh. oh wow, hey he has melons here. That's nice. Oh so he does have melons. So Jang had more than just wheat, he had a few melons, I guess. I guess this is what he used to eat, maybe, or maybe something else, who knows? What's this? Oh. Highway to spawn? What? No, we must keep digging. No one true. The, the one true path that ends here. Please enjoy your stay, visitors. Right, Jack. So this was a road to spawn. Oh. I didn't see this before when I tried to do this. Wow. Jang really was a bit of an architect. We got, we got nether quartz here. So, oh, so the southern pyramid of Valley of Wheat. So this takes place in different parts of the Valley of Wheat. This one keeps going to spawn, as well as to the Pyramid of Mules. Oh, wow, this is very. Good. So let's try to go to the Pyramid of Mules because I've never been there. So we'll go back there later to that intersection so we can explore the other pyramids. Now we saw the guest, the guest pyramid already, so we don't have to see that anymore. 
So I guess this leads to of mules, yes? All right, so considering this is taking a bit too long, let's just head back first, because I don't want to stay down here forever. Oh, it's a, oh, this is the Pyramid of Mule. Okay. Stairway to the Central pyram Pyramid. In the, what? In the Valley of Weed. So this is the Central Pyramid. Okay, then. So this was the center. Yes. Oh no, this is the center? Maybe? Is it? I think so. Okay, so that's I guess, so that's the central. There's the southern, there's the northern, there's the eastern, and then this is the west. Okay. This is the central valley of wheat town. Here we go. So he had melons and he had other crops. No. I'm so confused because every time I hear the Valley of Wheat and every time I see other people who did videos on the Valley of Wheat, I've never seen anything else besides wheat fields. But to see other crops being here surprises me completely altogether because every time I look at pictures as well as videos like FitMC's video as well as Rusher's video of this, I never saw it. So this place is unbelievable. Adapt. December 10, 2014. Welcome to the Valley of Potatoes. <laughs> so this is Valley of Potatoes. Not bad. Lava Man. Fire. Okay, I can't say that though. H N A S. This is always welcome. Please enjoy. So this was, I guess, a fishing pond. Okay. All I can think of is a rope. Is all I can think of is if, if TubeTT was full on historical warfare style, like, and then this was like, you know, a place of power like Egypt. <laughs> like, you know, you got Romans going on your door and then you get to, in, you know, the. Nah, I'm just kidding. I love the Valley of Wheat. I love you, Jake. So, so, this place is just amazing. I never got to see this. I'm, I'm so. I just. For, I'm just so overwhelmed by this time and. I am an effort that's been put into this. It's just so unbelievable that something like this can exist on 2 b 2 t the world's most chaotic anarchist server ever to ever exist. It just shows that what sometimes a single individual or a group of people can accomplish. That if we band together, we can build something great. Shame this place is gone. So how are we recording? Let me check. We're in about 11 minutes. I can guess there are a few more minutes. So... Yeah, so this is... So that was that pyramid. So what's this pyramid? I guess there should be a sign somewhere there. What's that? Okay, so this is the... Which pyramid is this though? Better not be the same one I went down to earlier, otherwise I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, so, okay, it's not. So this is one of the ones that lead to the intersection. So what pyramid did we just see? So this was the pyramid of crows. Sadly, they don't have crows yet. We've been to the pyramid of mules. We were, we came from the, from the tunnel, which is that one, which is the guest. So let's try to go to the Eastern Pyramid. So what's this one? Oh wait. Oh crap. Oh, this is this is the one I went to earlier. Oh, oh. such an idiot. I went, this is the that was the guest one. I got that confused with the other one. Okay, so let's try the other one, which is Pyramid of Mules, been there, Pyramid, Southern Valley, Pyramid, okay, so we've been from the Crow, so let's go to the, to the southern one. This feels so Egyptian to me. What's this one? Free bread. Right. So this is the Southern Pyramid. Where's, which one is this? 
Oh, it's this one. Oh, okay. All right then. Man, this place is amazing. So yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, this is pretty much my short base tour of the Valley of Wheat by Jang, and yeah. I will do Asgard 2 in a few days. It's Thursday now, but there's no school today due, due to a few due to some inspection from our city's government. So today I was able to get I was given the free time to you know do what I want. So I decided to record today this video. Now later I will be posting some For Honor content after I post this video once I finish editing it because I want to add some music to this one to make it feel epic. So. Yeah, anyway guys, I will start posting console content soon on this channel. Things like Grand Theft Auto V, Red Dead Redemption 2 online, as well as... I also will be posting... Fallout New Vegas content on this channel. It'll be recorded from my PC because I play New Vegas on PC with mods. Specifically, not gaming changing mods, just, you know, like, you know, better, better textures or whatever, etc. Anyway, so that's all I have to say for you guys. Anyway, so yeah, I will be posting Sing For Honor content later, like I said, later after I finish editing and posting this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will be posting Asgard 2 in if the Asgard 2 sorry. I will be posting the Asgard 2 base tour for in a few days. So yeah, so stay tuned. I'm Scythe I'm Scythe 2 Signing off.